Hello my lovely lot on YouTube. How are you doing? I hope you're well. I uh, hope you checked out my latest Poundland haul video because that was pretty cool. Um, but for now I said that I was going to be bringing you a stocking filler video. Um, I lost my last stocking. I don't know where it is. But I brought a new one which is pretty much the same. It's just not um, kind of hessian or whatever you call it. So yeah, that cost a pound and today we're going to fill it up. I said we were going to do a £10 challenge as, you know, all of my Poundland hauls, they're under or at £10. So this one won't be any different. Um, I'm going to fill it up. £10 is all you need to fill up a stocking from Poundland for somebody for Christmas. It's going to be very mix and match. I don't like my stockings to be one set theme. So say I've got a stocking just full of socks, like how boring. I do like socks for Christmas though, so yeah. So everything's going to be a little bit different, um, shall I just show you what I've got in here? So here's my sack, and let's fill it up. So first of all, I want I always get the heavier stuff at the bottom, because if you put the heavier stuff on stuff, then you're going to break or dent stuff. So let's begin. We have washing up liquid. Again, I said it was going to be all over the place, but obviously you'll get a twin pack for a pound. It's perfect. It's a nice size as well. Um, 550 millilitres. Um, so yeah, this is literally one pound. Stick it in the stocking. Obviously, everything that I brought is actually a pound. So I'm going to stop telling you how much money stuff is. So yeah, one pound. I just did it again. Okay, next. So I've got a few bits and I'm just going to grab these because I thought these were really cool. And I think if you're going to get them in a stocking, it would really stand out like against everything else. And... <laughs> They look weird. They are flurries, I think is how you pronounce it. Flurries. I think they're meant to be a dark version of Twinkies from the United States. Um, yeah, they're really cool. I've not had one um, because obviously it's for this video and I didn't want to just eat the whole box and be like, and then we have these. But yeah, we have these flurries. They are going in my stocking and that is £2 done. Um, my stocking's starting to get full. I don't know if you can see that. But yeah, my stocking is on the way. So, Christmas, I love Christmas, I love the smells, everything about it, the decorations. So I thought, why not go for something nice looking, I suppose, which is going to smell nice. And this is actually not Christmassy, it's Exotic Mango. And it's one of these reed diffusers, obviously a pound. And yeah, it's really nice, it looks good. Um, if I saw it anywhere else, I would have said three, four pound. But that is going in our stocking. Everybody loves a bit of a play around, right? <laughs> this is one of them joke present things that I just decided had to go in there. We have a gun. It's not a real gun. Disclaimer, it's not a real gun. It's more of a Nerf dart gun. Yeah, it's, it's a dart gun. So you've got these little foam pellets. And if it was a kid's stocking, which it wouldn't be because I put washing up liquid in there. But if it was, they'd love this. If it's for an older person who can shoot their children with darts things um foam darts on christmas day when they're not doing what they're told perfect anyway that is another one going in our stocking where are we at we're at four pound so far so i've got another few bits in front of me obviously i'm gonna go for something yummy jaffa cakes i think you can't go wrong with jaffa cakes right um there's 18 in here it says rrp 229 which is a little bit annoying but at the same time, only paid a pound for these, so I don't really mind. So yeah, here's another one going in our stockings. So that's five pound so far. Okay, uh, let's go for this one, shall we? We have, and while you're here, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the bell notification, and let me know what the coolest item is in this bag that I've picked out, because I'd love to know. Toothbrushes. Okay, so you might have an electric toothbrush, but I've... <sighs> I personally think that there's more uses to a toothbrush than brushing your teeth. Have you ever tried to clean out certain areas of the bathroom? You're like, ugh, but then you use a toothbrush. There's what, eight in this? It's gonna last somebody a year if they're just using it for like cleaning purposes. And plus, have you ever like had someone stay around and they're like, you got a spare toothbrush? I have eight. So yeah, perfect little gift. It's big and it fills out the stocking nicely. So there's another one. I've lost count. Up here somewhere will be a tally of how much I've spent. If I can figure out how to do it, I'm not the best tech savvy person. Next is something that I found hilarious and I'm probably going to give to somebody in my family. They'll know when they open it. But it's toilet roll. It's crime scene toilet roll. 
So it's like, it's like a crime scene tape and it's basically like, when you've had a bad one, give it a few because that smells. And it's got a little turd there, which says under investigation. And I just think this is pretty cool. If you went into somewhere that sold this sort of stuff, like only this sort of stuff, you'd probably be looking at about 3 99 one pound. And do you know where it's going? In my stocking, which is actually getting pretty full up. I don't know if you can see. I will tie it up at the end and then you'll be able to see. We've only actually got a couple of bits left. So lastly, second from last, yeah, second from last, shortbread. My other half basically turned around and said you have to pick this up. Apparently shortbread is a Christmas thing. I just eat it all year round and don't really care. But yeah, um, shortbread biscuits, product of Scotland and you've got a nice little tin. Um, you get to keep the tin afterwards. I don't know what you do with it because it's not the biggest of tins. There is 200 grams worth inside, but it's up to you if you want to keep the tin, maybe for decoration. I don't know. I'd probably just eat it and then recycle the tin. Always recycle. Okay, so I'm trying to fit it in the... This is what I mean. I've spent one more thing. One more thing before I say what I was about to say. Foil. I don't know if you're like me and you go for a lot of foil every Christmas. But we do. My mum always gets one in her stocking as well. This is five metres. It will do you for Christmas. You know when you've got uh, like, stuff that just needs foil? Foil. And it's probably going to poke out the top of the stocking as well. And it's... Um, I, can't, I can't fit it in a stocking. One sec. Okay, done. Um, it's worth mentioning that obviously some people wrap up the presents that go in a stocking. So you're not going to see the tin foil sticking out if you wrap it up. But if you... Don't, then I don't think it really matters, but I've just zipped up the stocking, and as you can see, it's pretty full. Pretty full. Um, so yeah, I only actually spent, as I think, £9 on the items inside, because the bag also cost me £1, and I didn't want to be like, here's £10 worth of items, but then you actually have to pay £1 for the stocking, because that's £11. And then if you do wrap it up, obviously that's going to be more money, but always check out wrapping paper in the sales because we brought, I think it was something like 500 meters last year for a couple of pound. The sales are great in January. So yeah, you can fill a Christmas stocking up with just nine pound in Poundland. How great is that? And the stuff that's in there, they have multiple uses. They have great uses. Tin foil you use all year round. Toothbrushes you can use for cleaning and your teeth and getting in those hard to reach places. So yeah, you can fill a stocking up with nine pound. Poundland is great, they have so much to offer. There was so much I wanted to put in the stocking as well, but I couldn't because I wanted to stick to that nine pound for you. So yeah, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment. Let me know what the best item in the stocking was. So yeah, just, just give me a like, subscribe. Let me know what you like about my videos as well so I can make some new ones in the future. And I hope that you are trying to save money when you, I don't know, pack stockings, buy Christmas gifts, whatever it is. Food shopping, just have fun, have a great Christmas and enjoy yourself. Thanks for watching.